Hello and welcome back to the uh, great Austro-Hungarian Empire, which, if you look at a faction map mode, is uh, just lacking Ireland now. We'll have the entirety of Europe. And Malta as well as Cyprus. These ah. two islands. And I think one Greek island that the Ottomans are in, able to uh, to actually take over, but... Soon. Yeah. Soon. Oh, wait, what about Denmark? Uh, They've just been sitting there the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Which there's a they they damn, <laughs> but yeah. We, How did we, we miss the Danes? We forgot about them. How did I miss the Danes? I took over Scandinavia. Yeah, I was there. That was like a thing that happened. Mm. Well, huh? Sure. Where do I have motorized divisions? So strange. Just trying to expand my African empire. <laughs> I'm just expanding into Africa pretty hard. There's all these people. The problem is they've already taken the manpower, so I'm not gaining anything. Whereas I could have just gained a few thousand men there, a few hundred thousand even. Yeah. I'm just going to delete Italian troops because I don't want them. Send them home. Wait, why do you own Africa? Because I've been asking for it. What the hell? That's what I've just been talking about. <laughs> I wanted some Africa, so I asked for some Africa. Where's my Africa? You never asked for any. Mm -hmm. Fine. There you All go. Right. I've got a nice little little bit now. That'll do. Looks like a nice bit. I'm happy with that. They still haven't destroyed the Belgian area over there. Because we do seriously need to get through to South Africa down there. Mm -hmm. That needs to, like, happen. Because I'm running into trouble in India now. But at least the land will start being taken in my name, which means... Manpower. Well, not all of it will be. But hopefully enough. What are these guys even doing? Just hurry up and get to your front lines and start taking over the enemies. Really that simple. Okay. Swedish infantry. Oh, they just landed. Damn the Swedes. Wait. You took over Israel. Yeah. <laughs> you just wanted the Holy Land. Yes. <laughs> That's what I wanted. I thought Israel actually had a claim on this for like after the war. Could be. Guess when Israel was born. Mm hmm. Worked. Unless I'm mixing up mods or something. No, I think they. You definitely, you're definitely able to play as Israel, and Palestine, mm. and even the People's Front of, of Judea. <laughs> <laughs> Which I find funny. Alright, what else do I want in this world? Have you conquered Ireland yet? No. What about Denmark? No, I'm not interested in Denmark actually. Can, is Denmark allowed? Are they like our Switzerland? <laughs> Wait, have we taken Switzerland? Oh yeah, we have. Yep. Uh, yeah, let them. I mean, th they don't do any harm, do they? Well, neither did the uh, Afghans. <laughs> or the I, I, honestly, I don't mind. I mean, if I was to take over uh, Danish mainland, it, it would just look terrible. So you should definitely take it. I don't really care about Iceland. I could take that over and Greenland, but I don't know. I think if you just invade the mainland, you can take it over. Nah, my men are busy. No. So. Trying and failing to go through India. What armies even are these? Is that Portuguese flag? I think no, it's not. It's an Afghan. Yeah, I was thinking those damned Portuguese better not be getting on the wrong side of us. Better not. I am progressing through India. It's just. 
it's a bit slow. I think I've only got infantry over there where I should be getting some. Yeah, I don't have any of my uh, motorized divisions over there. Are you a motorized division? Yes, you are. And your Iranian border is empty. Where are all the Iranians? <laughs> there are no Iranians. Okay, that looks nice. Still, Belgium still exists. What the hell, Italy? Fucking hell. Yeah, they're taking their time. It's kind of annoying, actually. Yes. Help my ground. Where is this army going? There's another army of Finlanders. How many Finlanders did I take? Just, damn it, Finland. Too many of you. Hmm. Alright, the Finlanders are going to go through Tibet. That's going to be their little job. When they get there, what other armies do we have? We have you. Oh, I don't know. Oh, there goes Iraq. Cool. Yeah. Glad they're out of the way. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is not even like difficult or anything. It's just fun. Not yet. Well, if the US ever decide to join, it could be difficult, but. They would put a lot of men in places we don't want them. Hmm. Yeah. Which is why maybe we should try flipping like Mexico to our side. Yeah. Well, yeah. We need some foothold. I think Venezuela would be the best, but they just don't. They're just not interested. So I don't know. Now Mexico's nowhere near turning fascist. I have so many uh, points. I'm gonna work on Mexico turning fascist. It might eventually happen. Mm -hmm. What's this Italian stuff? Baghdad. Can you uh, can you take over Baghdad whole? Because that looks kind of shitty. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're on the way. I even own stuff. I even own parts of Baghdad now, even though I didn't <laughs> set foot there. You took over the Italian parts. Yeah, and then they invaded that from my lands. There's Swedes down in Iraq. Yeah. Just Come on! Go away! There's damn Swedes everywhere. Alright, Saudi Arabia's next. Nice. That'll probably all end up going to you. <sighs> yeah, yeah, probably. Actually, there is still Ku Ku Kuwait you can take over. Yeah, those are the Swedes. Yeah. They've just turned British, apparently. Oh, no, no, no. Sweet again. Let's go get these men to finish up, and then I might go for Iran, because I will have them surrounded on all sides. Oh, this peace deal is probably going to smash this world all over the place. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully we can win before the US gets involved, but it looks like... We will. Pretty we sure. just need to go to the islands, because after India, all it is is South Africa, New Zealand, Canada, Australia. Yeah. That is all it is, literally, mm -hmm. after British Rye. So if you look about learning how ships work, get over to Canada, capitulate them. Yeah. I'll deal with India. And hopefully someone else will go to Australia or something. I don't think we need to get all of them. Hopefully India, Canada, and South Africa will be enough. I don't know, though. Oh my god, look at Siam. Yeah. Holy shit. But they're not they're moving. It's still not cut off. Yeah, no one's moving over there. Hmm. It's just one big stalemate. <laughs> <laughs> they are useless, aren't they? Yeah. And they still have my uh, my colonies there. Maybe I should build something here. To take over yeah. Singapore. Or just Australia and New Zealand. But, uh, that's effort. 
I'm gonna take over Ireland first. Once yes. That is done. Uh, we can talk about other stuff. Get the Irish done. From Liverpool, let's go ahead and I don't know, just go right here. Oh. Twenty paratroopers should be enough. Cool. Oh, uh, oh. god damn it! They heard us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, the Philippines. God damn it. Now they're going to cause an issue with ships. Mm-hmm. I'm building a navy 15, now. 15,000 planes. <laughs> Hundreds <laughs> of divisions. I just got over 150,000 manpower. Thank you, India. Yeah. Thank you very much, India, for all of that manpower. Oh, they're going to put men all on all, all the front lines which yep. we're struggling, are going to get men now. That's why I'm hoping to take over Ireland before that happens. Oh, yeah, yeah obviously, yeah, execute yeah. the plan. That would be smart. Yeah, that'd help. <laughs> I've, I've been wondering, like, what, what has it taken so long? What has it taken so long? But that, there it is. Where's this navy gone? Is that navy... Where have all of my navies gone? I can no longer s see them. Maybe, maybe they're dead. Maybe you never had any. I did. I had three. And apparently they still exist because I can still recruit things towards them. Hmm. I can see a ship there getting defeated. I also have this entire yellow army over here. Think That's you'll need help in Ireland? It's... um... meh. I don't think so. Good. Don't think so. Good stuff. All right. Iceland has a port. So Iceland to Greenland to Canada. Sounds like a way to go. Mm -hmm. For someone who has manpower, which isn't invading India. Um, Whomever that may be. I don't know who you mean. <laughs> <laughs> Cannot think of uh, anyone. Oh, what's this? Flexible line. Production efficiency growth. Eh. Streamline. There's all these lines going to New to Australia, but Japan just isn't following through. Yeah. You know. Right, this army's going to Africa, if they can make it. It's the only line left. Just don't sail all around the Horn of Africa to get there. Go through Europe, please. Go through Europe, march down, sail across again. Because there are still massive navies about. Mm -hmm. I don't want to get fucked over. Nope. Don't I reckon they are, because they're going to Portsmouth. Not Portsmouth, uh, Plymouth to go down. So I reckon they're going to go all the way down to my part of Africa. Hmm. They are stupid. Okay, I'm gonna take over Ireland in no time. I reckon if you're not using points anymore, you should be influencing fascism in Mexico and Brazil. Because they have massive armies. Yeah, but I'm still using these points actually. Are you? Yeah. Okie dokie. Still need them. But yeah, I will as soon as I as I'm done. These guys better not. And they do want to sail down to Africa. But not my Africa. They are going to go into one of the more northern bits. But I still reckon they're all going to die. Oh, there's my navy. Oh. It's down to three submarines from the original 69. <laughs> Great. I think they may have been killed. Mm, maybe. Considering I have constantly been producing submarines to go there as well. Please no one catch these 23 divisions. There's probably 230,000 men right there. I do not want them to die. Preferably. 
Did I ever finish with uh, Iraq? Nearly. Men forward. Uh. And then the Saudis can be destroyed afterwards. And the Iranians eventually. Not bad. India is slowly feeding me manpower, but it's barely a gain because I'm losing the men to take it over. Mm. Yeah, I see. There's still a positive thing about India, how you just get your manpower back. Where it's am I using students. motorized? This is so strange. Where am I using motorized troops? I don't have any motorized. I have mechanized. Some support divisions need motorized. Oh, really? Ah. Yeah, that's why there's a motorized thing on their screen. Ah, I see. Okay, thank you. The mystery has been solved. Mm -hmm. Show outdated equipment. Portugal just looks like it wants to be taken out, but I know the Spanish can't handle it. Other than that, it's just me there. The Portuguese have about a hundred divisions there. There's twenty odd of mine, twenty odd of the other guys. It ain't happening. But at least they're not sending out. Oh, well then, why do we turn them fascists? Oh, ah, good. All the points I've not been spending for all these episodes. We could have had Portugal, Brazil, and Mexico fascist by now. Yeah. All their massive armies joining us. I mean, Portugal in Africa, they'd get all their men to the border of that area and just go through them. It would be glorious. Belfast has fallen. Excellent. So there's that. Ireland will fall very soon. I just need, well, Dublin and Cork both. Yeah. Who's that army over there? There's an army over here, which is it? Oh, no, there's not an army over there. Yeah, there is. It's this, this army. Alright. Just confusing myself. <laughs> it's always helpful. Oh, I want to get to Delhi. When I have control of that, it's going to give me quite a few thousand men. And it's going to be great. This yellow army still might get to Africa without dying, which is another positive. Oh, yes. The Italians seem to be leaving the African front by quite a bit. They've opened up some lines. Mm. They're marching through uh, North Africa now. And that Greek island still has not fallen to the Turks. They're just useless. What even have the Turks done? Mm, nothing, I believe. No, they're just garrisoning their own land and failing to take over an island. It's not the best of Help. things. Yeah. yeah. But I've taken uh, Dublin now, as well as Belfast. Yeah, when that island's done, it'll uh, be good. Mm -hmm. We just need to destroy our enemies and all in the world will be great. Yeah, soon enough. Oh, but now we got the US, haven't we? So we're not even going to capitulate people. No. They've got between 218 and 700 odd divisions. Mm -hmm. It's too many. Well, I mean, once. Right, because otherwise, if we had been able to capitulate United Kingdom and win the war, then I could have invaded through uh, Canada, 
but yeah. Uh, I mean, we, we still we go might, through the northern yeah, islands. Yeah, we can still yeah, Iceland, Greenland, and then yeah, we'll do that. I will do that. Saudi Arabia. All right. Yeah, it's just one less. Hopefully, the manpower from the nation will be. Uh, oh, I have I have been granted with Baghdad and everything. Well, what the? <laughs> Look at the most southern uh, Saudi Arabian province, Rub Al Khali. Yeah, it's got a population of forty-two. <laughs> <laughs> it's desert. But yeah, that is funny. Just forty-two. Yeah. Cool. Wait, uh, now I'll probably do for the episode now anyway. Um, I need to check. But it's first on South Georgia. <laughs> What is this? Northern England. Oh, I see. I have the uh, I have people in the wrong thing. Uh. No. No. Oh, whenever you're stop. ready, it's time. Yeah, I'm not ready just yet. There we are. I don't mind. I have nothing else. All right. Yeah, I'm ready. I just oh. I was oh. just wondering why my people are not moving. But yeah. Anyways, um, so. Island is being invaded now, as well as, well, Saudi Arabia, apparently. <laughs> and still India. And India, of course. But yeah, you're making some progress, so that's good. Anyways, uh, thank you so much for joining us, and we'll see you guys next time. Later.